What's up, boo? Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a great day. And if you're new to my channel, welcome to the dark side because today I got some new mods to show you for The Sims 4. I have a handful of gameplay mods, some rework mods, and then a cast and build by set. But let's go ahead and just jump right in because I am going to show you the first skill. or oh, not the first skill. All right, so the first mod I want to show you is the functional ballet skill from Jane Simpson. For those of you who are not new to my channel, you know we've covered a lot of Jane Simpson's functional skills before. And this one is no different. It gives you a functional ballet skill. Your Sims are able to participate in that activity. I, th I think, yeah, activity. And it is base game compatible. So let's go ahead and just set up our new Sim here. This is Pepper. For those of you who are wondering who this Sim is, I deleted my entire mods folder and my saves and I'm starting over. Okay, so I went ahead and turned the second bedroom in her house into a dance studio because she lives alone. And we're not gonna get a roommate because they don't mind nerves. But anyway, this mod comes with a lot of stuff so it comes with the bar which your sims can go and they can practice ballet it comes with a spot that your sims can click on to do ballet and it also comes with a career and it comes with some items for cast so i actually went ahead and gave her the outfit i don't know if she's gonna switch into it because she didn't but i'm just gonna do it myself so let's do dresser change outfit it comes with two leotards and then like a tutu and it all comes with the um the point shoes and oh it's so cute now i don't really know that much about dance studios but i feel like this is a, this is okay if you've taken ballet or you know you know you spend your time in a dance studio like should i put mirrors in front of this or like a window i put the mirrors here so she can see herself but i thought that was cute um but i guess not but she got her ballet skill. And it says ballet. When you study ballet, you learn how to create art with just your body. Use your skills to tell stories and manipulate your audience emotions. Ballet skill is improved on the bar. Eventually, any, oh, it says anywhere. You know, reading is fundamental. Now I will say, I wish this was a game. Like I wish the Sims had more activity skills like this. I wish a lot of the skills weren't just under one umbrella, like the fitness skill. Like a lot of things are under the fitness skill, which I believe should have its own. I, you, let me know in the comments below what do you think well like what activities do you think should be added to the game even if it's a currently a mod or you know just in general because i feel like this, the game needs more activities for our sims to do i wonder if i should add more light to this room you know what i feel like i should kind of dark in here let me get the handy dandy saucers because those are the only filling lights i use i don't know about you but oh there's one already here but it don't give me light anyway back to the ballet skill this is cute Right, fitness prepper can now practice combinations on the floor and discuss great ballets with other sims Ooh, that's really cool actually you know a question of the video no well another question on the video if you like ballet what is your favorite ballet like let me know mine's is the nutcracker i and i've never seen a person i really want to like barbie nutcracker that's like the closest i've gotten to it you know the og barbie movies listen she Barbie was doing it. The animation was, you know, kind of, you know, but listen, it worked. Okay. It worked. I'm going to go and we're going to do, I'm going to up her skill ballet. Let's do level four and then practice ballet. Let me see. Is she going to do the same thing? Was that second position? I don't really, I, I don't, let me stop pretending I know ballet because I may have served two videos on TikTok. I'm really impressed with this. Okay, ballet, practice combinations. I wonder if it'll let me do any other. Okay, she's doing something completely different now. Yes, work them calf muscles, sis, because I made them bigger on purpose to match your thighs. I keep forgetting to do that in cast. Period. All right, I wonder if I can make her max level oh, okay we can pour, perform a variation that's still there now pra okay only practice is still in the bar perform variation clara Ooh. oh wow there's actually music with this you know what of course it's jane simpson your leg is shaky sis plie ma'am okay well, let's kick that in you know <laughs> listen all right so when you, if you put this in your house um make sure there's room at least she hit it though you know i mean i should have put it here yeah we'll do that for next time we'll move it over just i feel like mm, she did it though okay we're gonna fix we're gonna fix this real quick okay i moved it back so hopefully that helps it let's do this one and let's see is this one like i think so no 
it's not is it wasn't her name odette but she hand it though period let's watch her in the mirror okay well she ain't there no more da, 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 da. leg a little shaky sis period all right let's check out the career real quick because your sims can also be professional professional ballet dancers not just anyone can perform professionally 15 an hour from 4 to 8 p.m so monday through friday if your sims really want that and it's like practice ballet she's already done that i don't know what the okay junior company soloist is all oh brand selection oh we can be a teacher we can be a company dancer that makes this a company dancer and then a principal dancer and as a principal dancer she's the only, she has four ten an hour and she works from wednesday to sunday period so yeah make sure you go and check out the ballet skill mod from jane Sinston, and let's move on to the next mod all right so i'm gonna have pepper take a shower real quick because we're about to go out please now this mod i thought it was just some cool new backgrounds but this actually has a randomization of the background so it's not just choose one only have one but there's randomized backgrounds and it has the plumb in a different position you'll see once we leave is i'm gonna say it's revolutionary because it is like i've always wanted no i don't care about that little discovery thing i don't care so we're gonna go to the nightclub we're gonna go to we're gonna pop around so here's one of the backgrounds the plumb bobs in the bottom right and it's just just gorgeous now i'm gonna pop over to this restaurant real quick here's a different a different background here's a different little screen i didn't stop the video i didn't change anything this is the actual mod it's one file and it just randomizes everything so let's pop on over to this slot real quick boom different like how can we please get this in the set i like i i there's so many little screens that i just love but i hate that i have to like choose one like let me just have them all and uh we're gonna go right back to this because i think there's yeah here's another one i don't think we saw this one and i love that the plumb bob's in the bottom right that i love that because the plumb bob doesn't need to be in the center and of course there's no tip so yeah make sure you go and you check out this mod from cinematically and let's move on to the next mod all right so the next mod i want to show you is the west away child gameplay mod from persia and shout out to persia for sending this mod over to me i really appreciate it so this mod gives you some gameplay play in some options after the fact when your child is whisked away because as you all know sometimes it happens and sometimes there really aren't that many consequences or options that you can do when that happens so i'm gonna do what any other sim player would have done well actually not would have done but you know i'm just gonna go ahead and put this baby outside in a spot that they cannot get to because it is time to basically get this child taken away now i'm going i don't know how long this is going to take and i really can't do their needs or cheat their needs so we're just gonna have to we're we're, we're really just gonna have to wait here okay so i will see y'all in a minute all right it happened due to neglect kendrick is being whisked away to safety maybe you should consider a goldfish before jumping into parenthood again i wanted that to happen so now we have some new interactions we have have this new buff says baby whisked away an neglected baby can draw a tear from even the sta staunchiest sim and eliza has it too and we also should have a new option that says complain about child being whisked away which we can do also the i don't know if it's a trade or not child taken away from neglecting the child i never imagined that something ooh, that something like this could happen to my family i am feeling confused and overwhelmed right now questioning my parenting skills have i made some mistakes along the way am i feeling as a parent these thoughts are consuming me and i'm not sure how to move forward bob it wasn't your fault it was me booski i'm sorry now we should have all we got the neglected their child trait this sim never thought they could fail as a parent and have their child taken away oh here it is child taken away oh it's under the friendly category okay. so he has accused of losing their child Ooh, talk about their parenting fails question their relationship question their parenting skills put it into the debate find solutions express regret discuss how to get the child back let me see if we can go we can talk to eliza about this see if we get any responses let me know why is lilith here like what's 
what's going on here? So we have baby whisked away and then sad child being whisked away. I wonder if we can blame her. Let's blame Eliza. <laughs> Let's blame Eliza. This is under the friendly menu. I'll put this under the mean menu. Okay, question their parenting skills. I don't even think she cares. Actually, Eliza has no buzz. Like all the buffs are on Bob. Bob is really distraught about this. I'm sorry, Bob. Bob is just up here crying. Okay. Oh, we also got the child take. Oh, he is loud. We also got the new child taking away app. So you can do family care services, file a complaint, visit foster parents, visit CPS reporter. Need more explanation? You can visit the port reporter for more information. Like exactly what happened. We, we know what happened. Well, me and you know what happened. Okay. Me and you who was watching this video, we know what happened. But the Sims don't really know what happened. They just couldn't get to the baby. And Bob is just like, what's going on? Eliza just doesn't care. And Lilith has made herself at home because she can't go home now. I hate that for her. So Bob is bad. We got a new moodlet for this. And it says, this has to stop from coming back from the CPS. If I knew it would have never allowed the CPS to take my child. Ooh, uh, visit foster parent. Visit usually happen at a child children's a society office. So let's go and let's see. We'll go take a visit. Wish you can like bring along a parent if they really want to. At least she kind of heartbroken, but I don't really, uh, she cares at all. You know, actually Eliza has no job. I just realized that. Eliza a stay at home mom, period. That's the only thing we can agree on. Oh wait, she was a stay at home mom until they lost the child. Never mind. You know what? I take that back. Gloomy. Okay, what do we get from here? Okay, just a meeting. Bob has only had the chance to meet the foster parents so far. From his brief interaction with them, he got the impression that they are very caring Sims. And then maybe file a complaint. Make a complaint regarding the removal of your kid to the court of justice. You need to pay 2,500 simoleons for the lawyer to accompany you. Child Protective Services can take your child from home only if the agency has a court order authorizing it to do so or if a CPS caseworker believes that the emergency situation exists to warrant an emergency removal. Like this mod really adds in gameplay for the aftermath of when your kid is taken away. Cause in the game, it's just like, what? You just get the notification, the kid is gone and that's about it. And then like Liza still has the, oh, actually she doesn't have the moolet anymore. I, it ran out. I didn't cheat it. She still has a new baby emote. Not the emo, but the new baby emo because she just had the kid. But the child gets taken away, that's gone. And it's like, it's gone pretty quickly. There is a lot, a lot to this mod, which I'm going to cut it right here. But if you want to continue on and you want to learn more, then make sure you go and check out this mod from Persia. Thank you again for sending this mod over to me. I really appreciate it. But let's move on to the next mod. All right, so the final mod I'm going to show you is the Bridgerton Wedding DC pack from Sibylette. And shout out to Sibylette for sending this mod over to me. I really appreciate it. This gives you a a lot of bill buy items that resemble the you know world of Bridgerton, which is the Regency period. Now I'm going to try to find all the items, all the chairs. This is the seating so far. I got the bench and the high chair. I wonder if, let me just take off the reshade real quick. So here is the table. We're just do this like we would any other pack for the Sims 4. So let me see if I can bring everything out. These are some huge tables, and I'm pretty sure they come in different swatches like the top part is yeah yeah the little drapery effect you can change uh let's do another red what about these what are the swatches for this that looks good that looks good now if you're a friend of bridgerton and you really love putting on weddings in the sims 4 this may be the pack for you I just want to make sure I like change the swatches. Oh, that, that is really cute. I really like it. Uh, this is a wedding dance. Oh, hey, okay. this is, that's huge. Are these different swatches? Oh, they are. Oh, <gasps> that's gorgeous. I really love the red. All right, Uh, what is this? That's, that's a different mod. Here is a serving table. This is a bar that looks cute little drinks so it'll be cute if it came with some drinks is this the wreath this is a huge wait what is this this is an arch oh it's a wedding arch okay that's actually an arch it's your sim say there i do Ooh, the red what is this this is a oh this is like maybe for the table we can use this this is a oh some wall floral so you have walls you can put these decor items on there this is a oh cake box so what is this used for i don't need sybe eats mod to be functional oh okay so you can actually 
actually put a cake in here. This is a wedding mirror. Ooh, I'm gonna be saying ooh a lot. Okay, I'm sorry. Apologies. And you can just change, you can have this the regular mirror or you can put like the little flowers on top to match the rest of the deco decor options. This is a ceiling flower. Okay, let me see. Oh, ooh. Imagine if you do like a lot of those. That'll be cool. This is a pagoda. Oh, pagoda. Okay. Oh, this is the top for it. I see. I see. So let me, can I move this? Yeah, that. Oh, I love that. This is, you get a lot of options. What else? This is a macaroon tray, which you'll need, I believe, SYB Eats to make functional. Your Sims can actually go and get this. Got a candelabra. This is a lemonade jar. I actually want some lemonade. I should go give me some donuts. This is a drink pal for toast. This is a plate set. And what is this? This is a gifts pile. Do I have an extra table? I do have another table. This is a decor wedding cake. This is a cage. I don't know why you would need a bird cage, but you know, it'd be like that sometimes. And then this is a chandelier. I believe that is everything. Oh, what is this? Oh, a lantern. So I guess for like outside, these are some huge lanterns. So you can like put these outside if you really want to. That looks good. I'm trying to make sure and double check that I didn't forget anything. Mm, yep. I think that's it. All right. So yeah, that is the British Your Wedding Pack from Sibilet. Thank you so much for sending this over to me. I really appreciate it. And I am actually looking forward to like, you know, the new Bridgerton season. Let me know in the comments below if you are a fan of Bridgerton and who is your favorite, even if you read the books, um, who is your favorite? Well, who is your favorite couple from the books? But yeah, that is the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you made it to the end of this video, put the point shoes because we did cover the ballet mod at the beginning of this video. And I'll see you next time. Bye, boo.